Alright guys, this is Caleb back from Newbie Tech Company with my uh, full review of the Razer Nostromo. Um, so as you can see on my computer right now, I have pulled up the, the software uh, that I downloaded off their website, um, Razer Nostromo. Um, and you can see the device on the screen right here, uh, all lit up in its glory, but I'm sure you guys want to see the real thing. This is it right here. I have it set up on my left side because that's where it goes. Um, it's used by your left hand, uh, while over here you're using your right hand all at the same time. Um, so if we look at this guy, it's all lit up, um, and it looks a lot better than on my on my camera. If you guys watch the uh, unboxing, you know that I'm using my, my phone camera because uh, I am underfunded right now. So... Um, but yes, that is what it looks like, um, all plugged in and lit up, and, and you can actually turn the, the lights off uh, with the switch right there. If you guys can see that switch. Um, so you can uh, turn the lights off there, and then also in the software I'm about to, to walk you guys through, you can uh, even change the brightness settings. So you can turn it down a little bit, uh, or like I, like I showed you, uh, you can turn it off completely. So. Um, as of right now, I have this all set to the default uh, with all the shortcuts and stuff because you can set all the shortcuts. Um, and again, I apologize for my camera. Uh, I, will, I will work on that, I promise. So, uh, um, the, uh, one of the cool features is you can set different key maps. Um, and as I can see down here, uh, there's key map 1 right there, key map 2, key map 3, and then so on and so forth. And you can see those different uh, colors. Uh, so when I click on key map 2, as you can see right here, I got uh, the, that blue light right there. Um, and then on, when I click on key map 2, as you can see right there, uh, that red light is on. And I click apply, and then mine turns red. So, um, and you can uh, hotkey uh, buttons. Uh, most people prefer this single button up here, uh, that button right there, to uh, scroll through your key maps. So when you're playing something like World of Warcraft and... And you're doing different things like uh, tanking, and you got your different um, your scenarios and stuff like that. And uh, people say this is there; these aren't enough keys to, to cover all your your skills and stuff like that. Um, and with a single click of a button, you can change so your hotkeys change. And um, so it's just a really really intuitive thing uh, that they put in there. So you know, I can I can click on number three and hit apply, and then uh, and then it'll turn green. So and then key map four apply and then it'll be red and blue so you get a little bit of uh, functionality there I'm just gonna keep it at key map one um, so this is the software uh, very very simple design uh, you, you choose what all the buttons you uh, will be shortcutted to so right now like uh, you can see my three and then my seven my eight and my nine are also the directional keys, so I have them set to uh, WSD, uh, WASD. So just like uh, directional pads and like World of Warcraft and stuff, and I can just I can move around with these with these three buttons right here, um, and then I guess that one too. So all four buttons. Um, also, they uh, they have this little joystick here, um, and uh, like I showed in my unboxing, you can actually take the joystick off, and then it's just. Uh, your four button directional pad. Um, but I'll put that on there for now because I like having the uh, the joystick. Anyway, um, I guess I'll uh, show you a little demo here. I'll go go ahead and log in to, to World of Warcraft. Um, but yeah, I've been playing around with it for a while, and uh, it really does make my game easier. Um, I know a lot of people say, you know, oh, you're just lazy and you can't just use a regular keyboard. And I mean, I used a regular keyboard for a long time and was fine with it. But um, this just just really simplifies things and makes it a lot easier. And you pretty much just dance around your enemies. Um, it's pretty fun. So, and like I said in my unboxing video, this isn't just for the gamer. Um, I put in my wrong password. Uh, this isn't just for the gamer, this is for people who do photo editing and stuff like that. Uh, a lot of people who use Photoshop have uh, a lot of shortcuts and, and keyboard shortcuts that they want to be able to access without having to, to use multiple keys and so they just hotkey uh, those multiple keys um, into, into this device. So, um, as you can see here, I got my game running. 
Um, and then uh, over here, uh, what I tend to do is, uh, is just hold the button here to go forward, and then, as you can see, I'm going forward. Um, and then I use actually use my joystick to steer. Um, and I steer like that. So I mean, if I'm going, you know, I can steer and stuff like that. Um, so you know, very very simple to use, um, and it does feel really good. I mean, my hands uh, feel a lot more comfortable on this uh, this ergonomic design pad. Um, it just it just makes things a lot easier. So I mean, that was that was uh, my full review. Uh, very 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 simple thing to use. Uh, the the software is is really user friendly. Um, I forgot to mention your scroll wheel here, um, which works however you want it. I have it set to just be like a normal scroll wheel and change my zoom and stuff like that. So, um, but yeah, that is the uh, the Razer Nostromo. Uh, very very handy device um, and something that you should definitely pick up. So again, I thank you guys for watching. Uh, please leave comments. Uh, anything you can you can tell me to make my videos better. I really appreciate it. Alrighty, thanks for watching.